What is up Guardians, Blissfire 911 here, back with another Destiny tutorial video for the Vault of Glass. Today's video is just a pretty short one, it's just the <laughs> chests and the drop into the Gorgon Maze, or Gorgon's Labyrinth. So today, I'm just going to show you how to get the two chests and how to get through the labyrinth. It shouldn't be a long video at all. Alright, first up, you just run through the door that the Templar was in front of. And jump off the giant cliff. Now, if you're a Titan, you'll want to hit X quite a little bit before you hit the ground to slow yourself down. Um, with the Warlock and the Hunter, you want to hit X right before you hit the ground to stop yourself. Because they both have a different jump style than the Titan. So I'm going to show you with the Titan. And you want to hit X about now. Guardian down. There you go. And you'll almost die, but you'll survive. Pretty basic. Pretty easy. <sighs> Guardian down. Not very easy for them, evidently. <laughs> Guardian, Guardian down. down. Alright, and then we just run up to the left here. Oh, if you're a Titan, go ahead and put on your Striker class. And if you're a Blade Dancer, go ahead and put on your Blade Dancing class. Because it will help on the jumping puzzle, uh, having your super there charged and ready to go. So now we just keep following the video here, jumped up, ran through the cave, run down this way. We are going for the chest that has a chance to drop an exotic. Right here. Now if you get seen by a Gorgon and kill it, these doors will be shut, so you know, can't get seen before you get these chests. And I have already opened the chest this week, but just showing you where it's at and how to get it. Pretty simple. Alright, once everybody has done this, um, if your fire team is patient enough, you can let everybody go in and out with all their characters to open the chest. Because all you have to do is wipe and it will be closed again. You can run right back up here and get it. Just have one guy stay in the raid. I usually host a Gorgon chest every week. So stay tuned to my Facebook and Twitter for uh, posts about when I will be hosting it. Uh, Iron Banner was this week, so I didn't do one this week. But I will be back to hosting them again this next week so for the other chest just run straight down the river here watch your mini map all right when you get up here there will be a gorgon to the right when you get here we just want to watch our mini map he's in front now you see it's moving as soon as that gets straight to your right that's when you run now and you're just gonna run straight through the door and the chest is right there on the platform just have your whole team follow you, and then after you get this chest, your guys are done getting chests in the Gorgon Maze, and you're ready to just wipe, and as soon as you respawn like this, you're going to run and follow the exact path I do. Now, this first Gorgon that you just saw go through will not be that fast all the time, so just wait for him to go around this rock and kind of follow him. Now, once the Gorgon has gone around the rock, you are going to wait until the mini-map. He's about right there. And then run up here, take a right through here. It's really simple, just keep running. Even if this Gorgon makes noise, run down this path. You don't stop running the entire time. Run over here, take a slight left, go through the little valley. And then you have to be here careful here because your guardian that can kill everything in the galaxy can't run over a two inch rock, so you have to go around it. Pretty stupid. Alright, and that's pretty much it for the Gorgon Maze, guys. If you liked the video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for three more Vault of Glass videos, including the jumping puzzle with every character, the Gatekeepers, and Atheon. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you later.